Yo, what up, everybody? This is your boy UTX Shax by Zam, switching it up like I always do, bringing y'all some Battlefield 3 Rush. We're attacking on Operation Metro. I'm rocking the AN94. This is another episode of one of my Defeat series. This is the second one, episode two. You know, the whole point of this series is I took a loss this game. And I don't know. I just kind of want to explain how this game kind of just fell towards that. And I do think the odds were kind of put against us. I do feel like the other team had a lot more skill compared to our team. If you just look at the leaderboard or the scoreboard or whatever. I mean, Colonels, having Colonels doesn't mean a thing. Honestly. I mean, there's just a little bit of numbers and it's just an icon to look at. It's just a little bit of a fear factor. The more kernels you have, the more of a fear factor it sets. And you know, one thing that I noticed in this game in particular was that my team was making really good pushes up to this point. <laughs> it just felt like once we got inside into the metro, everything just kind of fell apart. I'm pretty sure that's happened to you guys before. And these guys were using the USAS. They were. They had it out. Not USAS frag rounds, just a regular USAS. That's still a really deadly gun, especially on this map. Watch me get these stats. Never mind. <laughs> I run through my man's claymore, take him out. But these guys are all posted up in here. I think I end up getting the plant. Nope. I get dropped. M1014. I mean, one thing I know that we could have done better. Could have made some better pushes. Because, I mean, honestly, I think if you just make really good pushes and really good strikes, you will easily, easily win on this map. I think you see me and my man Turner just running and running. I think what me and him were trying to go through here was just try to get through as cleanly as possible. You see me pulling out my knife trying to run faster. See if we can get that arm in. And there was a point in time where we armed both objectives. And I think I, we could have won this game but it wasn't for a mistake that I made during this game. Thing is, I think there is a moment where I got either greedy or my ticket saving abilities just <laughs> greedy medic bot zam all right i think i just went ahead and just tried to revive as many people as possible because you never know that one ticket could probably win you a game but in this case it's operation metro we have what 33 tickets left i mean something needs to be done here fast honestly my whole mindset here was to try to put as much pressure on the enemy as possible but I could not do that another good thing I could have done in this situation was try to get behind their spawn or just try to get in their spawn and kill as many of them as possible we have spawn beacon set up T-Ug set up it's me trying to revive my boy here in direct line of fire there's a sniper pointing at us well, I mean I don't know if you guys are in situations like these where you're on the low ticket count. Get an assault kit. One of the best kits to use in Rush. Honestly. I mean, again, like I always say, pick your boys up. One of the best things you can do in the game just to help your team win. And also, yo, look at look how many points I'm getting for heals. This is. <laughs> I'm getting like 700, 800 points just for healing people, man. Not revives. And here's where I think I made that fatal mistake. They armed B, I was like, man, what should I do? Should I run back for Bravo? Because I thought they already had that one covered. I saw two or three people, and then I saw the bomb get blown up. And I was like, man, I need to revive all these people because I don't see anyone else doing it, you know? Greedy Medic Bazam. That's what they call me. Well, that's what I call myself. And the, th <laughs> the bomb site was still blinking at the time. I thought we clutched it, man. I thought we had it. But we didn't. So, I mean, do you guys think if I would have ran back, we would have had it? I mean, what's your guys' thought process? So, I mean, maybe I could have revived some people on the B flag or B objective, B bomb site, whatever. I don't know. 
But yeah, man. I think we took a loss because of that one careless mistake. I don't know. Maybe could have ran different, but right here, I thought we still had time. But everyone's getting dropped. Right now, the other team was inspired, and they all pushed us up. <laughs> I played a few rounds with these guys. Really competitive games, man. Even added one dude on the other team. Anyways, this is your boy, ETX Shacks, and I'm out.